Methodist churches in East Texas and all around the country are voting on whether they should stay or leave the United Methodist Church. It's a story that we first brought you back in May and now decisions are being made. Fox 51's Lauren Margolis is here to explain more on the decision that pastors and other members are left to make and why. Lauren. Corinne, we spoke with two Tyler churches today, Lane's Chapel United Methodist Church and Fairwood United Methodist Church. They share their different beliefs with me and explain why they chose to leave or stay with the UMC. This spring, some congregations started questioning if they should disaffiliate from the United Methodist Church. Lane's Chapel United Methodist Church making their decision in August. We will be disaffiliating from the United Methodist Church at the end of the year. Pastor Jeff Gage explains the reason for their vote. It's not the denominational structure that troubles us. It's what's happening across the denomination that is contrary to what we see as solid biblical teaching. One of those beliefs having to do with LGBT issues. A part of this discussion is homosexual marriage. And there are many who want to celebrate homosexual marriage within our churches and that pastors will officiate in those services. But for those of us for whom we see that that, that is not a marriage that is blessed by God, we know we're not going to do that. Discussions will continue for years before any changes are made within the UMC, but many are already leaving before that. There is always going to be misinformation out there. Currently, the United Methodist Church is not changing any of its doctrine or policies until a vote is taken at the next general conference, which will not be held until 2024. Fairwood United Methodist Church and Tyler deciding to stay in the UMC recently, at least for the time being. Now, I think we as Fairwood United Methodist are living into the call to be a United Methodist Church because we love what it currently stands for. Whether choosing to stay or leave the UMC, both churches tell me their hearts break over this division. I wept openly. Uh, before my church because I hated, I knew, I knew we had to do it. I knew we had to do it, but I hated to see it happen. My heart breaks for those colleagues that have chosen to leave and for those other congregations to leave. Making an extremely difficult decision and standing up for their beliefs. Lane's Chapel will vote on November 13th to either remain independent or join the Global Methodist Church. It's a denomination based on conservative Methodist teachings. It was launched this year and it's where some congregations are choosing to go next. Live in studio, Lauren Margolis, Fox 51 News.